Chandler, for so long, I, I wondered if I would ever find my prince, my soulmate. Then three years ago, at another wedding, I turned to a friend for comfort. And instead, I found everything that I'd ever been looking for my whole life. You don't have a boyfriend because... <laughs> I don't... I don't know why you don't have a boyfriend. You are one of my favorite people and the most beautiful woman I've ever known in real life. I think you're great. I think you're sweet and you're smart. That night meant a lot to me, too. But when I'm with you, and we're together, oh my god. Welcome to an adult relationship. We're in a relationship? Because I'm in love with Monica. That's right. I love her. I love her. I love you, Monica. I love you too, Chandler. Wasn't it a lot more exciting when we were, you know, all over each other all the time? Yeah, that was great. That was really great. But to tell you the truth, I'm more excited about where we are now. I've never been in a relationship that's lasted this long before. You know, to get past the beginning and still want to be around each other all the time? Well, I think that's pretty incredible. And the fact that this is all happening with you, yeah, I think that's pretty exciting. Place, but I would never expect you to worry about that. You're not easy going, but you're, you're passionate, and that's good. And when you get upset about the little things... But I, the mess! It's not as important as the fact that Phoebe took care of the babies all by herself. I think that I'm pretty good at right. making you feel better about that. So they can say that you're high maintenance, but it's okay because I like maintaining you. Yes, if it really doesn't mean anything because you know that I'm just not ready. I know. I know. Hey, did she buy it? Totally. I can't believe you're gonna ask Monica to marry you. I know. You look beautiful. Thank you. She left. I can't believe I ruined this. You wanted it to be a surprise. Chandler, in all my life, I never thought I would be so lucky. The only thing that matters is the you. You make me happier than I ever thought I could be. And if you let me, I will spend the rest of my life trying to make you feel the same way. <laughs> Monica.
I, I don't I don't want a big fancy wedding. Sure you do. No. I want everything that you just said. I want a marriage. destined to end up together. I think that we fell in love and we work hard at our relationship. Old job, new job, and you. I love you so much. Please promise me that you will never leave me, that we will grow old together and be with each other for the rest of our lives. having babies someday. I'm not saying it has to be right now, but I'm starting to think that we can handle it. But nothing has to happen until you're ready. Well, maybe I'm ready now. I mean, it's a little scary, but th maybe it's right. She's amazing and beautiful and smart. What I have with my wife is pretty great. We've been trying to have a baby for over a year. I just think it's a good idea to find out if everything's okay. Is there a problem? Is there a problem with me or with you? Actually, it's both of us. What? It means that we can keep trying. There's a good chance this may never happen for us. Oh my God. I'm sorry. I'm sorry too. How would you like to have a baby that's half yours and half his? No. I just realized I don't care if he is the most perfect guy in the world. It's not you. And if I can't get pregnant with you, then I don't want to get pregnant by him or anyone else. Really? Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. So you know, this leaves us with... Adoption. What's going on? That was the adoption agency. And? We're getting a baby! My wife's an incredible woman. She is loving, and devoted, and caring. I love my wife more than anything in this world. And it, it kills me that I can't give her a baby. I really want a kid. When that day finally comes, I'll learn how to be a good dad. But my wife, she's already there. She's a mother. Without a baby, you still want that baby? You know it's twins, right? We have waited so long for this. I don't care if it's two babies. Taking them home because they are our children. Okay. We decided that we didn't want to raise a kid in the city. We already found a house we love. What? We got the house. Oh my god. This was your first home. And it was a happy place. Filled with love and laughter. Monica, 
I thought this was going to be the most difficult thing I ever had to do. But when I saw you walking down that aisle, I realized how simple it was. I love you. Any surprises that come our way, it's okay because I will always love you. You are the person I was meant to spend the rest of my life with. With our future before us. I only want to spend it with you, my prince, my soulmate, my friend.